Xbox on Snap. So we are, I believe, a couple chapters in the three. I'm at the point, I believe, or... Dude, you better go up and see Bill. He doesn't like to wait. So, you should probably go. Oh. Rebecca! She's a strong woman, surrounded by weak men. I ain't letting my kid get raised around that. Get in here. Alvin? Alvin! He passed out hours ago. He can't hear nothing. No point in making a racket. You're a bully. Come again? You're just a bully. I know it wasn't a fair fight. Yeah, I suppose it wasn't. But life ain't fair most of the time. I wouldn't be so concerned about his well-being if I were you. Not with you being so close to the fire yourself. <laughs> now. You make sure you tell me the truth when you're sitting where you are. <laughs> and you won't end up over in that chair. Now, you might not believe this after what happened earlier, but I liked Reggie. He was a funny guy. He kept things light. You need folks like that. It's easy to let depression sink Boy. in during times like this. Self-grandizing asshole. And I don't mean just because he was maimed. That wasn't his problem. Yeah, anyways, he was we're in the middle of, will, of Chapter 3, as weak you can of see. Weak characters. This is, uh, and we can't have We're that supposed to go here. get some radios. Not anymore. Not with what we got at stake. He didn't deserve that. Even if he messed up, he didn't deserve to die. Oh, he certainly did. You see, Reggie put us at risk with his incompetence. He's had a string of screws <coughs> lately. Me. Killing one in order to save many is part of survival. It's one of the tough decisions that a weaker person couldn't make. It's why it falls to people like us to lead them to safety. You understand? I like how. Well, I wish it was different. I do. Clementine but they are weak, level. and we are like strong. That's why it's our responsibility to shepherd the flock, to keep them safe. It's their nature to follow, not to lead. I know. I have to do everything for them. It's exhausting. Of course it is, but that's the role you're meant to play, and we're more alike than you think. There's no way you could have lasted this long otherwise. I realized it back in that cabin. You were scared. But you looked me straight in the eye. Kept your nerve. That's what we need. If we're gonna get through this, the next generation <laughs> has to be stronger than the last to lead us out of this. Kids like you, raised the right way. The way my child will be raised. It ain't this herd that keeps me up at night. We can handle that. It's not knowing. If I got anyone to hand all this off to. But I ain't worried about that anymore. What if it's not yours? Well, even if that was true, it's mine now. Alright, now. Well, you there? I like how he just takes. Whether it's mine yeah, or not, it's I'm here. mine. The loading bay door is jacked. Troy really knocked the shit out of it. How bad is it? Rails are tweaked so it won't shut all the way. I don't think it's an emergency or anything, but it's something Stan should take a look at when he can. I'll get him on it. Out. That fucking idiot. Heard on its way, and he puts a goddamn ding in my door. Go on back out to the yard. It's I mean, almost supper time. I look at his ideas, and it's one of those things where it's like... His mindset is in the right place. But it's the way he gets a gets to that place it's so conflicted 
<clears throat> I mean, he, you know, he just wants to protect his people. He's trying to set up a community, and everybody's got to be a part of it. Know what happened this morning. I don't know what that son of a bitch is gonna do next. You know. So you want to ring the dinner bell for a herd of walkers to show know. up? How is that better? Cause this place will be weight, fucking chaos you know, when that thing hits. That no one will be paying any attention to us, and that's when we go. It's our opening. You know, or, or we just gotta figure out a way to draw them to us. Your friend here wants to get us killed by lurkers before Bill can do it. What is it with you? Like, that's I don't think he ever like had an intention to let Reggie you know back that's in. Not what he's I think saying, he knew that Reggie was a it does sound weak link. Dangerous. This shit is all dangerous. Maybe Luke could help us. He's outside. He wants a radio to help keep an eye on the guards. Thank you. That's the plan I vote for. You know about Luke? He flagged us down when Troy wasn't looking. Told us his plan. Mentioned he talked to you. If Luke can tell us what's going on with the guards, we can use that to pick a good time to escape. That seems reasonable. Who knows when that'll be? There was <clears throat> a girl back at Crawford that used church bells to send walkers all over the city. We just need something really loud. The PA system Carver is always using is quite loud. Yes, There's some is. speakers outside the building, pointed toward the parking lot. I saw them when we were walking out to the work. Troy's always standing next to one of them. He's right. I saw them too. Really? <laughs> it's all controlled in Bill's office. There's a switch in there that'll turn them on. How do you know that? I used to make a lot of the announcements back in the day. I had it flipped on once. Luckily, there wasn't <clears> much <throat> around at the time to hear it. It was plenty loud, though. I'd love to know That's how perfect. she got involved we with Carver, We just gotta get into but, his office. Why didn't you, know, you say something sooner? It's probably... Because it doesn't change anything. This isn't a discussion about how to do it. It's probably similar to most of Carver's It's a discussion about whether it's stupid. He wanted an heir. And it's still stupid. And maybe the he sensible felt she was a strong woman. Or maybe she came on to an him. Opening. You're know, real difficult to deal with sometimes. Penny. No, that's all right. You ain't exactly a peach either. We need to get out of here soon. And the herd is right there. I'd rather take my chances with them than Carver. Atta girl. Look, it doesn't have to be mutually exclusive. Getting Luke the radio is helpful whatever we end up doing. It doesn't hurt to have more information. You know what? Fine. I can get behind that. Okay, so we get yes, that can, turn radio. Kenny. He keeps us posted on the herd's movement. We fire up the PA thing and bring the yeah. walkers to roll over this place. And I then like Kenny, but he's get some a bit guns and shoot our way out. I don't you know? know. Whatever we can. We improvise. Then that's not a plan. You don't plan to improvise. I figured out what your problem is. You don't think this stuff through. If the end of the plan is just nope. to stroll through a herd of he walkers, most certainly then doesn't. you should know from the jump there's no way it's ever going to work. Actually, I do it all the time. <laughs> First words I ever hear you say, and it's just some crazy, stupid shit. Hush. What do you mean exactly? When you cover yourself in their smell. Rub the walker guts all over you. They can't tell you from one of them. Now I don't know who's crazier. Trust me, I've walked through herds before. It works. You just have to keep calm and make sure you're good and covered. Lee figured that out. What? It's how we got out of the marsh house. Lee covered me and we walked right through. Really? Holy shit. Oh, good one, Lee. <laughs> All right, what are we waiting for? Let's get that stupid radio. Lee keeps on giving. We still giving. have to find a way to get in the stock room. I got a plan for that, too. Come on, kid. Gonna need your help. Where the hell did she come from? We just need to use the winch. She can just climb up from there. Then, just drop into one of the skylights over the stock room. There are shelves and stuff for you to land on, so... You probably won't fall. <coughs> yeah, Great. Didn't that, that thing breaks all the time. Like, oh yeah, you can unless just go something's up there changed, and... it won't support much weight. Oh like, uh, yeah, that thing kind of tried to kill. Come on, up and at him. Kill Don't somebody last her, time. Kenny. She's our best bet. I mean that, Clem. Now or never, yeah. I guess. That's my girl. We got to get that rope down. Mike, you want to boost her up? Come on, kid. Yeah, I don't let go. Know, I, I like you. Kenny. He's a nice guy. His heart's always in the right place. It genuinely is. But uh I don't know.
Try to hurry, all right? I don't think they're the sharpest guards in the world, but they're no idiots either. <laughs> they see you not in your bunk, we're all done. Boy, this is... Shit, he's coming back. I gotta let you <coughs> go. I can't stand here. Grab something. We're in trouble. Yeah, we are. Yeah, I think Carver underestimates the danger of the horde. Or the... the... Yeah. Yeah, you know, even with this being on Xbox One, there's still times when it hitches and stalls. Man, you're not gonna believe what I'm looking at. There's got two or three thousand of them out there. In the parking lot? No, not in the parking lot. I can't see them all, but I see the dust they're kicking up. So you're not sure? What, about how many there are? Yeah. How can I be? Fuck. I hope they pass by us. God, yeah. Oh, yeah. You think we're ready this time? I don't know. Bill thinks we are. Of course he does, but he thought the same thing last time. We learned a lot since last time. Is it enough, though? We'll find out if they turn this way. Yeah. Yeah. Sadly, it's not. <clears throat> but yeah, every now and then it hitches. I mean, it's not terrible, just noticeable. It's crazy about Reggie, huh? Yeah. Yeah, this is one of the better episodes, and it's when you finally really uh, get to choose a future path. I don't think I'm going to let him back in. Huh. You don't? No. Do you? I don't know. You know, I think Clementine genuinely so really, no starts bullshit. deciding the type of person she's going to be. I think so. The homestead, at least. <coughs> I'm not sure about the expansion. They're out there just moaning. It's rough. That's what they do. It's driving me crazy. It's really unnerving. I know what you mean. You figure we'd be used to it by now. I wouldn't figure that. You never got used to a light buzzing or anything? A little different when it's dead human beings walking around. I'll give you that one. So what are you doing tomorrow? Bill wants me to start getting this bay door fixed. Is that why you're down there? Yep. What happened to it again? Troy backed into it when we brought the prisoners, the, the new people in. See, it's hard not to call them prisoners. Anyway, I'm looking at it now. I don't think we have what we need. Jesus, really? We repurposed a lot of shit to get this place built. I can't say for sure if we even had the materials before we started expanding. I need a smoke. Whew. Easy peasy. You get him? Okay, jump down. I got you. We best get in bed. Troy will be back any minute. Well? You little devil. Everybody stay where you are. No need draw on suspicion. That was so cool. Thank you, Clem. <laughs> I told you you probably wouldn't die. Nice job. Ugh, Jane. Thanks. Yep. Anyway, get some rest. I thought about Duck today, about his dumb little face. First things that come to mind are 
Always the dumb things he was doing. <clears throat> Kid was always running in circles. Every damn place he went, he'd just run. He couldn't stop him. Makes it harder to remember he was a good boy. Well, yeah. long day tomorrow. One long day. As much as Duck was an idiot, it was really sad to see Duck go. But it proved the point. You know, and served its purpose to show that the series wasn't squeamish to pull punches. And it was a all right. Movie. We're all here. It wasn't just a. Someone's got to get shocked. the radio out to Luke. It What's the problem? We should purpose. probably figure out who's doing what before we. Time to get up. Daylight's burning. They let you sleep in, all things considered. Where's my dad? He's where the rest of you are going. To work. <coughs> Rebecca, Nick, Sarah, Jane. If you gotta take a piss, do it now. The next break won't be for a while. Troy will be coming up for the rest of you. Why just them? Like I said, Troy's coming for the rest of you. <laughs> Uh, I won't be hurt, Sarah. Yo. All right, Should look. Go. If we're gonna do something, we have to do it now. And <clears> that's <throat> all we got. Kind of and we pair up with him. I can do it. Where's the meeting? Mike. Yeah? Clementine should do it. Are you fucking kidding? <laughs> no offense, but come on. That's crazy. She's a kid. Why would. There's a million reasons. She knows Luke. She can hide. She got the damn radio for us in the first place. Who cares? And I'm sorry, Mike, but I don't know you from fucking Adam, all right? And if I'm trusting someone to do something this important, I'm trusting her. Yep. Kenny's right. I should do it. Don't do something stupid just to get some respect. She doesn't need your respect. Give me the radio. All right, little chickens. Let's get to pecking. All right. I don't think today's gonna be like yesterday. No way. No shenanigans. This rooster's gonna be surveilling your ass every second of the day, you hear? Got that? I'm afraid I need an answer, girl. I heard you, okay? Good. Come on. Oh, you have your pockets all out. Gonna get your tags all snagged on something. Let's go! Big antenna sticking out the front of the pocket. Oh, no, I don't notice that. <coughs> hey, she's with me? Oh, shit, I almost uh, forgot. Yeah. Well, take her then. I don't care. Wait, wait, what's going on? Never mind. Just chores of a different sort. Come on, city mouse. Can't you cut her a break? She'd really rather keep with us, people she knows. Okay. It's okay. Come on. I just wanted to make sure you were all right. I didn't believe you when you told me about Reggie. I ran and found Bill once I left you. Figured even if he had done it, he'd make up some sort of excuse. But Bill was just so matter-of-fact about it. Like he'd pulled up a weed or something. Like it had to be done. And that was just one of those moments when your blood runs cold. Goose pimples up and down your arm. Because it turns out the person you thought you knew was never there. You look anxious, Clementine. Something the matter? Bonnie's a follower, though. She's not a no, she's just looking. You know you can talk to me, right? Stay safe. I Trust was enough. dishonest when I first met you, but I swear on everything holy that'll never happen again. Bonnie, Luke's waiting for me to give this to him. He needs it. Clementine? And all I need from you 
is to just not care where I am for 15 minutes. If you get caught and you mention my name, Carver will be the least of your troubles, okay? Well, what are you waiting for? <laughs> I need you to not care where I am. <clears throat> you should get going. Bill don't like idle hands. Like, uh, uh, better hurry that shit up. I, I hate babysitting you assholes. He acts tough, and if I hear, like, we get on the radio and then he gives everybody up, and it's like, Jesus, dude, that sucks. Luke, it's me, Clementine. It's safe to come out. Anyways. Bloodstain. That looks really old. He's probably fine. Luke! Where is he? I know shit. Luke! If you're hiding, come out! Yeah, it would be wise for you to come out. Was he asleep? I swear to Christ you're gonna regret this! I was... Oh, you ain't supposed to be out here. You people been here one fucking day and already you're fucking up. Well, you wait and see what happens. Move! Hey! I'm the asshole with the gun, is, says the dude right there. Apologies for the coughing, by the way. I'm still getting over that sinus infection. Really Get sucks. over there. And how is it that we're repaid for our trust? With treachery? With deceit? Oh, there's Luke. With theft? They caught him. Yeah, that's what it looks like. Whatever you were planning is over. It's done. Huh. You can't just run from your problems. You can't just up and leave when it gets tough. Because there's nowhere else you can go where it ain't. Tough is all we got now. Get that through your fucking skulls. Michael Madsen. Such a good role. So Luke here, good. he can't help you now. You gotta help yourselves. You gotta help me find the strength to forgive you. Now you can start. By telling me where the other one is. I'm gonna count to three. If that radio... Ain't in my hand by then? We'll have to make things more difficult. One. Two. I found it. It's right here. I got it. Hmm. <clears throat> it's all right. Sorry about that. Not sure what I was thinking. Three. <laughs> Fucker. <gasps> oh. No! Oh, God! <gasps> Jesus Christ! Stop! Stop <sighs> him! Somebody stop him! Troy, do Let something! Stop! Clementine! Help you me! You don't have to do this, Bill! <sighs> no! Stop it! Kenny! <sighs> Kenny! <sighs> oh, little shit. Bill! That's enough, Bill! Please! Bill, there's a breach! All right, everyone come with me. Bonnie, you stick around. Make sure these folks don't get into any more trouble. Finally yeah, to see his true colors. okay. No yeah, supper for you all tonight. Luke's Maybe an empty up. stomach will give you some perspective. And we'll try this again tomorrow. 
Do your best with him, Carlos. You need to get him able to move, because we're leaving tonight. We're leaving tonight. <laughs> <clears throat> I like her. Strength of conviction now, the fact that she's willing to say, Nope, we are leaving now. There's uh, no tomorrow in this, oh. it's now. Dang it. Man, he beat Kenny bad. What'd she say? She said she can get us out of the pen if we get the PA system going. Second she hears it, she'll run over and spring us. That's great. It's not great. What are you talking about? Look, I know part of this is my fault. I, I, I know. We can't stay here. Exactly. We have no idea how long Alvin's got before Bill just kills him. We have to leave now. Look, I hear what you're saying, but it's <coughs> risky. Exactly. It is pretty damn risky, guys. Right. Risky? Did you see what that son of a bitch just did? The, the plan works. Nothing needs to change. It's all set up. The hard part is done. This guy's fucking crazy. Who knows what he'll do next? Yeah, but now we're dealing with a guy beat to shit, Sarita in no shape to do anything, and I'm a goddamn mess. Look, we should rest up. Okay, we should bide our time, and we should wait for an opening. Bonnie's agreeing to help us tonight. And that doesn't mean she can't do it some other night. I don't know, guys. Luke's making sense. Maybe we should wait. We're not waiting. Ain't nothing out there, guys. Trust me, I've looked. There's no food. There's no supplies. They picked everything clean. We need to leave now. It's only gonna get worse. You better fix him. You better. I'm doing my best. His orbital is crushed. I don't think there's much hope for the eye. I got him as stable as I could, cleaned it, got some of the swelling down, bandaged it as best I could. But until he wakes up, we won't know if there's any damage to the brain. <laughs> Fuck. Okay, look. Maybe I'm just playing devil's advocate here, but if... Damn it, if y'all are serious about going, <clears throat> then we're gonna have to start talking about maybe leaving some folks behind. No! There is no other way. This is bullshit. Well, I don't like it either, but guess what? It's where we're at. Kenny and I are only here because of you people, and now you intend to leave us behind. So we should risk all of our lives? No, we're not leaving Kenny. That's not fair. We stay together. Life ain't fair, Clem. We're just trying to make the best of a bad situation here. No one wants to leave Kenny. Good. Because he won't have to. I'm all right, hon. We leave tonight. Plan don't change. Not bad, old man. Thanks, asshole. You are one <laughs> tough bastard. Do tough bastards get their ass kicked in front of everybody? You all right? That wasn't your fault, okay? It's all right. <clears throat> all right. Well, then what now? Seth, we get the hell out of here. Give like him, now, now. Give yes. Anything. Where are we Seth. going? In case things get squirrely and we gotta make a break for it, we need a place to meet up. But hey, you we can do meet out at Parker's Run. The hell is that? It's a Civil War site a few miles north. Tourist trap. I'm curious that signs if all they're over. gonna Just follow make the road. a third one. We stopped well, I mean, there after we escaped the first time. Luke and Carlos one, know where it is. It's not that far. Well, at least if a few but folks don't know, know where it's at, it'll be easier to find if we're split up. All right, that works. Then we just need someone to go set off that PA, right? I mean, you never bother to explain who's supposed to do that. <coughs> oh yeah. Look to the twelve-year-old to solve all the problems. Wait, wait, hold on. She's the plan? Let's go. 
be sure to remember to flip the switch for the outdoor speakers. Just the indoor speakers might not draw the herd. It's right on the microphone box. Right. By default, it's set to play music, so you should just have to turn it <clears> on. <throat> then climb back up and drop into the stock room. We'll meet you there. <laughs> So easy. Down into the office, outdoor speaker switch, turn on PA, up to the roof, down into the stock room to meet you guys. That right? Perfect. Be careful. Okay. Anyways. I'll stop Clem, make sure you I bring Alvin. I just don't want to. I'd love to see a clean break. I know that people like to see characters revisited and whatnot, but... To be honest, the revisiting of characters in the second season from the first, Beyond Kenny, is almost useless. We see Omi for, what, two seconds? Krista for maybe five minutes. Alvin! And that's about it. I know there's a couple people that we see from the 400 Day expansion. You know, obviously Bonnie plays a significant Alvin? role from that. Are, are you okay? <clears throat> Okay, now the mic. What? What's wrong? I need a CD. <coughs> no, 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 no! No, where are they? It's right next to you, Clem. Come on now. Come on, come on. Please work. Yeah, nice. This 4th of July, make sure your backyard barbecue is complete with Howe's full line of products to meet your grilling needs. Yeah. Good old Alvin. What? What did they do to you, Alvin? Carver talks all that tough guy shit, then keeps the tiniest gun in the universe. <laughs> There's something funny about that. You have the project. We have <coughs> the project. They're coming. Come on. We have to go. I ain't going anywhere. But you are. Go on. I mean to get some oh, papers. No, we're leaving. We're all leaving. He's get his revenge. I ain't fit to move, Cap kid. Somebody. I've, I've run out of road. What? No, I'll, I'll just go up there and shut that thing off. You gotta get out of here. They'll be here any second. Thank you. You take care of my girls. I get the feeling it's, it's gonna be a girl. Just a hunch. <laughs> go on. <laughs> Until that point, I didn't really like <laughs> Alvin, but I liked the fact he was like, "You take care of my girls." From charcoal briquettes to propane tanks, <coughs> have all you need to make your day special. Here they come. This week only, Kennedy leaf blowers are twenty-two percent off. How's that for a deal? Warehouse. You want to disrespect me? Fine. You want to throw away the life I'm trying to build for us all? Then fucking fine. Want to run off with this dog shit group of crippled fucks? Then fine. Be my guest. But I will put a bullet in you and that. There you go. Get back. Come on, Luke. Oh, yeah. This ain't none of your business. Clem, where... Why isn't Alvin with you? Where is he? Shoot his ass. Alvin! 
Rebecca, I am... Oh, God, I am so sorry. Kill him. Rebecca, Rebecca, sweetie, my God. How did we get here, you and me? This is just a bit of a custody battle we got on our hands here. We should tie him up. Yeah. Yeah, okay. Okay, we got any rope? <laughs> Kane's ready for some payback. This is where Clementine gets her education. Go on <clears throat> and wait outside. We have to go. Kenny, please. I only need a minute. Go on. You don't need to see this. That girl's already seen more than you can imagine. Shut your mouth, Bill. You're all just gonna let him do this? I'm not going anywhere. It's gonna get messy. <laughs> I know. <laughs> yeah. Look at you. you. Fucking ingrates. I don't even know how good you got it. Always. Every time that's my decision. We turn Clementine into a grown up. Today. That's alright. You'll learn. She knows how the real world works. Lambs to the slaughter. No shepherd to guide you. Clementine knows exactly what I'm talking about. No, I'm not letting you see this. It's not your decision. Had a girl. She ain't <laughs> afraid to look it in the eye. You go with that feeling you got right now, Clementine. That's what makes you stronger than Come the rest on. of them. Let's go. Yeah, go on. Let the sheep out of the pen. We'll see how long that lasts. I'll be right there. You won't see anything. That's funny. Coming from you. How's that I? Just follow my voice. It'll get you there. You got a thick fucking skull, Kenneth. Should have put you out of your misery yeah. right there. <clears throat> Carver gonna get now me look at you right now. You don't mess. The fuck are you looking at, bitch? <clears throat> don't act like you didn't Why love every second. <laughs> Just into an unrecognizable mess. <clears throat> Reminds me of that scene Let's go. Drive when he stomps on the dude's face in the elevator. The point that you just hear the cracking of all the bones as the skull's caving in. You know who the leaders are at that point. Those are the people that are not afraid. <sighs> Fighting off the no, horror. No, I'm, I'm all the right. guns in the Come on. We got enough to worry about. Man, we're never going to make it through this. You kidding me? If Clem can handle it, you can. <clears throat> yeah, I love Shit. So I thought they were coming from the south. They did. Looks like we're Step in the eye the of it now. Fuck. This is fucked. Here. You're gonna need something. Thanks. Someone You guys better hurry up, up and get to smearing if you want to live. Or you can die here. It doesn't matter to me. Do it quick. We need to get covered uh, before the rest of them get close or we're fucked. This is See, that's what happens you I'll know, go first. when you live a protected You're gonna life. you put that on yourself? You know, they protect her. We have to, Sarah. <clears throat> She's lived 
such a protected existence. Okay, now you turn die. around. It smells gross. Shit. Everybody shut the fuck up and get covered. It'll be okay, honey. Just stay still. Uh, are you sure? I'm sure. There's nothing to fear if you remain calm. I'll keep you safe. Hurry the fuck up. Turn around. I'll get your back. We ain't got all day here. Everybody ready? They're almost on us. What in the actual fuck is going on here? What is this sick shit? Someone say something before I start... Hey, 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 hey! Don't you even fucking think about it, motherfucker. I will end you, you hear me? Troy. Troy, we talked about this. What? The fuck you talking about? I told you I wanted to get out. You said you'd help, then I'd help. I thought you meant get out of the pen, not whatever the <clears throat> fuck this shit is. I did, but now we can leave. Troy, you can come with us. What? Well, where would we go? Away from here, together. Man, you smell really bad. You gotta get a bath before we- <laughs> All right. <laughs> Shove a dick up! Come on. Yes. Don't make any noise. Up got it. All over again. You might hear something they don't like. And for fuck's sake, walk. Act like you belong, and you will belong. Get over here! I need more ammo. <clears throat> we got this, y'all. Shelter. Is that Tavia? Where's Bill? We need him up here! Stay calm. Shh. It'll be okay. Don't run. I need more ammo. Watch Sarah. <clears throat> Clementine, come help me. Call her down. Please, just say something. You're her friend. Clementine. Dad! we have to make. I don't know what else I'm gonna play tonight. Sarah's glasses. I'm not sure about She's Far gonna get Cry someone 4. killed. If I had said I had the radio, I almost thought about playing Carver Wolfenstein, might not have been I haven't as, finished that yet. as vicious to don't ever think that, I'm darling. That, uh, no telling what that, that asswipe would have done to you. So how's it look? Yet, that I really Am enjoy I still gonna be pretty when this I got a lot of those. You need to get past that walker without drawing <clears> the others. <throat> what are you gonna do? Not now. Not now, darling. Damn it, where the fuck is Luke? Oh, hell, 
still have They're all gonna die, Clementine. That I gotta Don't let them pull you down with them. Forza Horizon 2. Uh, Sunset Overdrive. Just so much stuff. Dragon Age. Oh, I haven't even, even finished the, the expansion chapter in Diablo 3. I finished the main campaign, but... <clears throat> you know, that's the kind of thing. People talk about how this has been a down year for games. It's like, I, I don't know. I don't think it's been a down year for games. I just think that we... We didn't have the standout game that we've had in the past. You know, that defining game that everybody can, can camp around. Um, you know, there was a lot of stuff that came out. But none of it really knocked it out of the park and made itself defined as, as the best thing out there. You know, last year you had Last of Us, which had everybody kind of, you know, circling around it. That's another one I didn't finish. I finished on PS3, but then I bought the remastered version because I never played the DLC. And so I need to finish that too. I got Infamous Second Son I haven't finished. Assassin's Creed Unity, Halo Collection, Last Gen Collection. <coughs> Bayonetta, I have Bayonetta 2. Sitting here on my Wii U, I haven't finished. I've only played through like the first couple chapters. So it's like, there's a lot of good stuff that came out. I really enjoyed Tales of the Borderlands. That first episode was really good. Excuse me. I didn't enjoy, um... Game of Thrones as much, except for the end. I, I did like some of the stuff at the end in that. Um, yeah, there's a ton of stuff. Like I said, people want to say that there wasn't a lot to, or this was an off year. But I think there was a lot of good stuff. Genuinely good stuff that came out. <clears throat> I just think it's that there's no Grand Theft Auto. That remaster came out too. I forgot about that. You know, a lot of good stuff came out. You know, and then I have FIFA, which I bought, and I've only played like half of one season so far. And when I finished that, uh, the Men this year was the first Men I played in like nine, ten years. It was pretty fantastic. I think the last Men I played. And my son didn't play on my profile. Last match was uh, 2006. I bought it when the 360 was coming out. And I wanted to, I wanted to play a Madden on next gen. 360 first came out. I bought Madden <coughs> because I bought Madden 06. She sees me in Roses XX and uh, Oh, and Dead or Alive. And a couple weeks later, I ended up buying uh, Marvel Ultimate Alliance. One of my favorite Marvel games. And I'm so sad that the second one was just awful. Vicarious Visions just didn't... They tried. They tried, but they just could not hit on what Raven did with the first one. You know, but by then Raven was being sucked into Call of Duty maps and whatnot, multiplayer stuff. <coughs> so. Well, anyways, I'm gonna take a break here for a little bit. Um, I gotta go run an errand or two real quick around the house, and then uh, I don't know. We'll pick something from that pile and, and play it for a bit. Hopefully you enjoyed our end of our chapter three run of uh I do like I do think that that chapter three is probably the strongest of the the uh season two chapters you know and the, sadly the problem was it it sent away probably one of the best protag or antagonists far too early I mean they could have really let Carver grow over another episode. It's kind of sad to see him get killed. You know, 
the end of this episode three, but man, Michael Madsen, what a thought. Bring in the heat with a great performance. So anyways, yeah, we'll be back in a little bit. We'll, we'll pop something else in. I'm not sure what, but we'll pop something in. We'll uh, keep going. So, uh, uh, it's MC Lazy J. Make sure if you want to follow me, that's me pretty much anywhere. Xbox, PlayStation, Raptor, Steam, Twitch. And uh, we'll be back in a little bit with something else to play.